What's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? So, I, I, I got to say this because I'm getting way too many DMs, way too many emails, but click the link up top, Nine Wives. I remember months ago when y'all was calling me Coons and a fake Malcolm X and uh, my kids are mixed, you ain't shit, you fake black nigga. And I, and I said, I'm giving y'all the information. I know what I'm doing. And now it's 2022 and my interviews are the primary sources for Terrence Crawford's case. So I got two things, fuck y'all, and two. If we want to make change, black media, black fighters, stand the fuck up. I ain't for this half shit. I'm not, I'm not for this half shit. We do it half time and if this is about Terrence Crawford $10 million, then let it be about Terrence Crawford $10 million. But if we gonna ride, we gonna ride. If Terrence Crawford gonna be out in that turn, we all going with him. I ain't going for this half-ass shit. Well, ha, Terrence Crawford won the case. They settled out of court. Nah, are we gonna take over boxing tonight? I'm talking to black media, black fans, black everything. And if you align with black people, stand up. That's all I got to say, man. I'm not for this halftime shit because I done stuck my neck out. I done lost the most. I done lost the most standing up. My, I done lost at least I, six figures. In YouTube money and, you know, the case maybe. I, I lost it. And I turned down $50,000 to turn my back on black people. The zone offered me $50,000. So we either all in or we all out. We can't hate Bob Arum and love Eddie Hearn. We can't hate Bob Arum and love Frank Warren. We can't do it. We can't do it. I, I, I'm not for this halftime marching shit. Nah, fuck that marching shit. Because every time we march, guess what? A nigga from Detroit goes and, you know what a man did and he's still alive to this day? He robbed Rosa Parks for $56 and he knew it was Rosa Parks and the man is still alive. No one killed them in jail and no one killed them on the street. Malcolm X killer is still fucking alive. He lives in Brooklyn. And we wanted, nah, we the in or we out. I don't give a fuck what we own, where you from, where you at, Republican, Democrat, Muslim, Christian, we the in or we out. Either, either this be about Terrence Crawford, $10 million, or we fucking take over boxing. Ter top ranked black fighters, where the fuck you at? PBC black fighters, trainers, where the fuck you at? Stand up or sit down. Because I don't want to hear, oh man, no, oh, I can't. We the in or we out, niggas. And, 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 and that's where I stand. I'm tired of all this halftime marching shit. All we do is fucking march and yell and make YouTube videos and tweets and nah, we grab our fucking gun and we go. That's what it's about. That's what this shit is about. Because guess what? We can't celebrate another nigga signing with top rank. We can't celebrate another nigga signing with uh, 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 the Zone and PBC and all these motherfuckers. No, fuck all of them. Fuck all of them. Ain't not one better than the other. So either we gonna pick up our rifles and ride, or we gonna lay docile. If Terrence Crawford is Nat Turner, I'm grabbing my burner. I repeat again, if Terrence Crawford is gonna be Nat Turner, I'm grabbing my burner. And, and Terrence Crawford, you better come back to the fucking people. That's all I'm saying. If you want the people to ride with you, you better come, you better come holler at me, nigga. And, and, and I stand ten toes down on this shit. I ain't no, I ain't no, I ain't no marching nigga. You understand what I'm saying? I'm not. I'm either all in or I'm all out. Or if not, I'm just gonna do my job as a journalist. Because Fred will ride. Period. End of discussion. When Bob Arums was yelled at Kate Abdo, everyone said, oh, that's just Bob being Bob. It was black, black men, Mexican men, Asian men. Oh, that's Bob being Bob. I fucking stood up. T Timothy Bradley didn't stand up. Uh, uh, Andre Ward didn't stand up. Bo Mack, Terrence Crawford didn't stand up. I did. So what we on? What we on? I challenge y'all, what we on? What we on? And this ain't about no pro-black mission. This is about getting our power back. 
If you a Mexican, stand your fucking ass up. If you Asian, stand your fucking blacks up. Because at the end of the day, Terrence Crawford get us $10 million. It's still gonna be about pimps and hoes. What the great Darwin Price said, boxing is about a game of pimps and hoes. Which side are you on? So either we gonna ride out, we gonna overthrow Eddie Hearn, Bob Arum, Al Heyman, Queensberry, Oscar, what we on? Mexican fighters are saying the same thing. Asian fighters with Honda over there in Japan are saying the same thing. Fighters, you deserve to have your power back. So again, if Terrence Crawford's gonna be Nat Turner, I'm gonna grab my burner. But I ain't heard from Terrence Crawford. I ain't heard. I'm not falling for the Callan Kaepernick nigga. Nigga take a knee and then he signed with Netflix to zone and get all this fucking money. Got money through perpetuity and we out here standing or we boycotting the NFL and all these black NFL. 80%, 78% NFL niggas are black and stunting on the gram and we out here fighting on the front line like hell, hell no. No justice, no peace. I'm not falling for that shit no more. I'm going to protect my last name. That's what I'm about. Protecting my last name and doing what I need to do. So what we on? Shakur Stevenson. Uh, the Price Brothers. What, what's their names? I don't know. What's that? Every black fighter there. What we on? What we on? Tag them. Tag they ass. Terrence Crawford. What we on? Bomac. What we on? PBC fighters. What we on? Y'all only fighting once a year too, niggas. The zone fighters, what we on? Andrade, you ain't got the big fight. Devin Haney out here begging for a unif uh, begging for a fucking unification. He's a world champion. What are we fucking on? I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. And, and everybody know, once Fred goes, Fred goes. I'm not for this halftime shit. Terrence Crawford disappears and gets his $10 million. Callan Kaepernick seals the court documents with the NFL and then goes signed with Disney, who has a deal with the NFL. Do y'all understand this shit? LeBron James storms out of the meeting in the bubble. The next day, he's taking a knee with the Nike shirt on. Do y'all understand how big this shit is? That's why Malcolm X is special. And I don't claim to be him, but I know how to win. You destroy him. You eliminate the enemy. The best place to kick a person is when they ass is down. The best person to shoot a motherfucker when he's been shot already. So let's stand up and go. I'm with it. I'm going back to my workout. Barbershop conversations of top nine wives. And this be the realest shit I've ever fucking said. Be the realest shit I ever fucking said. It ain't about no more interviews. It's about us standing up. Fighters, pull the fuck out. What we gonna do? What we gonna do at top rank? What we gonna do? What we gonna do? Don't tweet about it, Shakur. Don't tweet about it, Davis Brothers. Don't tweet about it, Berlanga. What we gonna do? What we on? What we on? So again, lastly, I'm going, Nat Turner, if Terrence Crawford gonna be Nat Turner, I got a few burners and I'm ready to go. I'm locked in, ready to go. But we half nigga, we half. What, Vince Carter? We half nigga, half African-American. <laughs> I'm gone, y'all. Yeah, I'm going to work out. Peace, y'all.